Joseph, can you please come to the living room for just a few minutes? What is it, Mom and Dad? Joseph, we're going to be celebrating Kate and D.W. getting really good grades in school this weekend, because they have both gotten the highest scores on their exams this past week. And they wanted to go to Dave and Buster's to celebrate. Wow, Dave and Buster's, I've always wanted to go there. It's like Chuck E. Cheese's, but they have hamburgers instead of pizza, and you can win Barney or Coco Melon toys at Dave and Buster's. Not so fast, Joseph, you're not coming with us. What do you mean I can't come to Dave and Buster's? Well, because you've been misbehaving a lot, not to mention falling behind in school, we decided to have a babysitter watch over you while we're celebrating Kate and D.W. getting good grades. But I am 11 years old, I don't need a babysitter. I'm too old for a babysitter. Now Joseph, don't get started with another tantrum. You're getting a babysitter because you act like you're three years old. <laughs> Don't get me a babysitter, 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 don't get me a babysitter. Please, I want to go to Dave and Buster's. Joseph, you're not coming with us to Dave and Buster's, like we just told you a moment ago. Now get up off the floor and stop acting like a big baby you are always acting like. All right then. Who's the babysitter going to be this time? You will get three guesses, and we'll tell you who it is if you guess wrong each time. Is it going to be Dave? No it isn't. He is really busy with his family, his new YouTube channel, and his job driving the school bus. You get two more guesses. I know, will it be, Karen, the best babysitter in the whole wild world, who gives me pizza whenever I want? Absolutely not. Karen is very entitled, and therefore, she is not a good influence on you. In fact, we told her to stay away from our house after DW had her babysit the two of you last year. However, you get one last guess. I hope it's someone who doesn't ground me every 30 minutes and doesn't let me watch Coco Melon or Super Simple Songs. Because those are the worst babysitters, ever. Will it be, Arthur? Definitely not. Your babysitter is going to be Ms. Gray. Wait, what? you got to be kidding me. No we're not, Joseph. That is who we hired to babysit you while we're at Dave and Buster's. She is one of the best babysitters in Go Animate City. I hope she and I will watch Coco Melon and Super Simple Songs. Not this again. Joseph. We told your babysitter that you can't be watching Coco Melon or Super Simple Songs because you're too old for baby shows, and number two, you're falling behind in the fifth grade, and there are only two weeks left in the school year. I have a feeling you're going to have to either repeat the fifth grade next school year or take summer school. That is so not fair. Why can't you let me watch Coco Melon and Super Simple Songs? That is much more entertaining than doing homework assignments all day long. Joseph, stop it. You're not watching Super Simple Songs and Coco Melon, and that's final. Your schoolwork is especially important. Now, very important, I want you on your best behavior for Miss Gray, otherwise you'll be grounded for the entire summer. Okay, Mom and Dad, I promise to behave myself for Miss Gray. You better keep your promise this time. That must be Ms. Gray, so, I think we should all get going. Remember what I said about your behavior. Hello, Joseph. So, you must be Ms. Gray, is that right? Yes, this is. And your parents wanted me to watch over you while they're having dinner in town. So first things first, I'm going to make us some dinner. What were you thinking? I was thinking, 
Let's order a pizza or hamburger from Uber Eats. I don't think that's a good idea. Your parents said not only I can't take you to any restaurant, we should not order food from Uber Eats either. And hamburgers and pizza aren't that healthy. I can make some chicken for dinner instead. But seriously, Miss Gray, I want to have a hamburger and pizza from Uber Eats. Joseph, I said we're not going to order food from Uber Eats. Instead, we can have chicken. You've had that before, and you like it. <laughs> I want hamburgers and pizza. 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 Please, I want you to order hamburgers and pizza from Uber Eats. Wow. Oh my goodness. You've got to be kidding me. I can't believe you're acting like a toddler and you're 11 years old. Like I said for the 1 millionth Googleplex time, I am not ordering any food from Uber Eats. Now sit on the couch while I make our lunch. He reminds me of when I was babysitting Dave last year. He was 35 years old and also acted like a toddler. Old MacDonald had a farm. E-I-E-I-O. And on this farm, he had a dog. E I E. I O. With a woof woof here and a woof woof there, here a woof, there a woof, everywhere a woof woof. Old MacDonald had a farm E I E I O. Joseph, lunch is ready. Wait a second, Miss Gray, I can't get enough of this song. It's the best one ever. Don't tell me you're watching Coco Melon. Because kids your age don't watch baby shows anymore. What do you mean? I like watching Coco Melon, and I'm not done with this song yet. Wait, what are you doing? Number one, you can't be watching TV because you're falling behind in school, and number two, you're too old to watch Coco Melon. Turn it back on. I was in the middle of watching Old MacDonald at a farm. I'm not going to turn the TV back on. Lunch is ready, and you don't want your food to get cold. I suggest coming into the dining room so we can eat. I can't have lunch without watching Coco Melon. So please, turn the TV back on so I can continue watching more Coco Melon songs. Absolutely, no. Not when you're acting like a three-year-old. Now please, come into the dining room so we can have lunch. I want to watch Coco Melon. 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 Why can't you turn the TV back on? Entitled Catherine. Joseph, I'm giving you one last chance to behave yourself, and then I am sending you to your room for 30 minutes, and I will also be calling your parents. I'm not going to stop crying until you turn the TV back on so I can watch Coco Melon. I want to watch TV, I want to watch TV, I want to watch TV. I want to eat my lunch while watching Coco Melon, is it that complicated? <coughs> That's it. Joseph, go upstairs to your room for 30 minutes. I will bring your lunch to you in 10 minutes. Do not slam doors. <laughs>